Welcome to another video guys, today we are going to unbox another modelette and today it is a pretty special model in my opinion it is the 747 Cathay Pacific in the old polished livery um, I bought this model from the airmail shop Switzerland so last time I, I have bought I think two models so far of this shop last time the, the verdict was pretty oh my god the verdict was pretty yeah bad or not not that good for this shop because uh, the packaging was pretty cheap and uh, this shop is pretty expensive so that's what I don't like and still don't like to this day okay let's see here we have some foam Oh, they improved a bit. They improved. Very nice. Okay, we have some foam. That's pretty nice, actually. I've never seen this. Um, the classic package chips. And more foam here. Nice. Okay, this packaging now looks pretty good, to be honest. This looks pretty nice. So, here we have the model. I don't like the sticker, to be honest. Um, maybe we can get rid of this. It's the prize, 53 Swiss francs. Okay, I'll leave it just on here because uh, otherwise the box will get damaged. And yeah, this is the box, guys. Looks pretty good, looks pretty nice. I think this is uh, a Hong Kong maybe in the 90s or 80s, it looks like. Awesome photo to me, in my opinion. Uh, here on the side, here it has already been opened, maybe, I'm not sure. Okay, anyway, we'll leave it like that and we will open the box here. Then another picture of Hong Kong. Um, it looks like an old picture, but damn, it looks pretty nice, this box. Here, Boeing 747-200. Oh yeah, the registration is VR-HKG. And the warning, as usual, barcode. And yeah, this is it for the box. So, let's open this thing up. So. And here we have it guys, okay, let's check this model out. So I think it's one of the first models that actually are in green and I'm really curious how the polished thing looks. Um, I have high expectations on this, but uh, we'll see. So, okay, let's open this one here. Come on, come on, okay. Okay, they removed the plastic and everything, I think they did a... I think they did a quality check actually, but I'm not sure, I just guess. So, here is the model and the polish, oh yeah, this one looks pretty good. Wait, I can show you this in the zoom part. Okay, the polish looks pretty good, also the model, pretty good. I think just the, the livery is a bit boring, but come on, it's, uh, it's an old livery, so I don't really mind. Okay, there we go guys, this is the model. And it's full glory. It looks pretty cool, really, I have to say. Um, I'm a bit disappointed of the livery. I didn't check the livery too much, but it's a bit boring livery in my opinion. But the model itself looks pretty cool. Also with the, the wingtips here. Oh, I haven't seen those. So, yeah, let's go to the zoom part, guys. Okay, there we go. Um... Not much to see here, just, um, is this another door at the top? Yeah, it looks like for, I think on the top it's the first class here. And, um, yeah, a lot of doors uh, below there, so that's pretty cool. Yeah, I can't really tell a lot, the delivery is pretty, um, not much to say about just green and white and the uh, red Cafe Pacific. Not much to see here. Then we have the engines. And of course we have this really nice wingtip, guys. This wingtip looks amazing. I will sh show it to you when we check the front and back. And of course I need to show you the polish. Here you can see the, the polish. And I think it is. Yeah, I think it is polished here. And the tail. Yeah, looks pretty cool actually. Yeah, I'm happy to have now such an old model. 
or not an old model, but like uh, the model represents an old aircraft. So, like this. And yeah, so, okay, I think it's not much to see here really, to be honest. I think the interesting part is this polish. Okay, I tried to show this to you very well. Um, Maybe I can zoom a bit more. Okay, my autofocus struggles a bit, so I tried to show it to you like this. So this is the polish. You can see it's like it's reflecting quite a bit. And there we have some other parts. So um, it looks pretty good actually. It looks really, really good. And I'm happy to have this polished one. So that is pretty cool. Um, what we also have here is the registration. Um, so, VR-HKG, VR if it would focus, yeah, there we go, nice. And now to the engines, um, the engines also look pretty good. Uh, when you see them, they look pretty nice. So, I think, I have to admit or to say, Phoenix did a very good job with, with this model. I have to say, I'm very impressed. And also the polish, it looks pretty cool, I have to say. So that's why I'm happy to have this model. And of course the wingtips here, they're so nice. You see them from the back here. It looks pretty cool. So, my verdict for this model. In my opinion, this model is pretty amazing. Especially if you like uh, old liveries, it's, it's really a must. I think for me I got it because like, yeah, it was one of the first, I can't remember when they did such old aircrafts, um, old aircrafts, and the Polish uh, livery looks pretty good, I have to say, they, they did, Phoenix did a really good job with this, and um, also the wingtips are pretty nice, um, okay, what I can see now, I'm not sure if you can see this on the video, one wingtip is bent. So that's not too good. Oh, look at this. I can bend it back. Okay, so, okay, pay attention with those here, with those wingtips. You can bend them very easily. Okay, maybe I've bent it, but okay, just to let you know, pay attention on these wingtips. You can bend them so easily and they're so thin, so pay attention. Okay, <laughs> anyways, um, this model is great, I'm glad to have it, and yeah, maybe you can buy it as well. So, this was it, I really like this model again, and um, yeah, I hope you like it as well. If so, please give me a thumbs up, and maybe subscribe would be pretty nice. I hope to unbox some more models very soon for you, and then we'll see us again. See you, your Phoenix Models Reviews.